up World Wide Web? We're out here in the woods, October 8th, Southwestern Ontario, and we found ourselves some enoki taki mushroom. So these enoki mushrooms resemble brioche buns, as my girlfriend says. Uh, they also have a bit of a slimy texture when they're fresh on the cap. One important thing to highlight with these mushrooms is that they look similar to the funeral bell or deadly gallerina which uh, has the terrible effect of shutting your liver and kidneys down before it kills you uh, and even an expert mushroom forager needs to be extremely careful when it comes to identifying enokis uh, if they plan on consuming them so a few of the distinguishing factors of the enoki versus the funeral bell is the enoki has the brown velvety texture down its stem towards the base uh, hence the name Velvet Foot uh, or Inokitaki. Another distinction is the veil line that is on the found on the Deadly Gallerina or the Funeral Bell. They have different gill and spore colors, uh, being that Inokis have white gills and spores, whereas the Funeral Bell has more of a brownish. As you can see from the red line, the ring on the deadly gallerina is formed from the partial veil that drops when the mushroom is young. They grow on the same wood, they can't even be in the same cluster, so each mushroom needs to be carefully selected uh, if one plans on consuming wild enoki mushroom. Uh, we have a whole section of them here growing on dead ash and they seem to like this flooded uh, plain area, all the moisture. And if you come in here, you can see something we found. And if you look behind here, they're even starting to grow behind the bark here. Mushrooms have been prized throughout history. One such mushroom is the enoki, or velvet foot, which has been cultivated for thousands of years, starting in Japan. A close relative of the wild version of this mushroom can now be found in grocery stores, but in the wild, they can be found throughout temperate parts of the entire world. Epidemiological studies in Japan showed that mortality from cancer is dramatically lower among people who eat the nokitaki mushroom. The wild species, I suspect, would only have further beneficial effects as they are the version humans would have co-evolved with in the wild ecosystems throughout time. Cultivated versions of enoki and enoki extracts in animal and test tube studies have also been shown to kill lymphoma, breast, liver, stomach, and cervical cancers, fight viral respiratory infections, and improve several measures of heart health, among many other health benefits. <laughs>